Okay, today we have a problem for divided by 3, divided by 2, and then divided by 1. And we need to solve this equation. So, to start with, let's calculate the first division, because if we have the same operations, in this case divisions, we need to work from left to right. We cannot do this, then this, and then this. This is against the rules. So let's do 4 divided by 3. Oh, let's write it like this. 4 divide 3. We'll leave it as a fraction because if we divide, we'll get a bad decimal. So what we do next, we need to divide by 2. So let's write it like this. Divide by 2. If we have division, we can also write it like multiplication. So we have 4 divided by 3, but here we multiply by 1 over 2. So we had 2 divided by 1, and we got multiplication, but 1 divided by 2. And now to multiply this, we need to multiply the numerators and denominators. So 4 times 1 is 4, and 3 times 2 is 6. And we can also simplify this fraction, because we can divide 4 by 2 to get 2, and we also can divide 6 by 2 to get 3. And all that is left is to divide by 1, but I guess that is pretty clear that we don't even need to do that, because everything that is divided or multiplied by 1 will stay the same. So in the end we get 2 divided by 3 as a solution. Watch this video next to check your skills. Subscribe.